I'm sure you've heard plenty of your friends say to you, ah, there's nothing to do in Panama City tonight. Au contraire, my friend, you forgot about the Bay Arts Alliance. The Bay Arts Alliance brings you culture right here to Panama City. They have some amazing shows coming up, not to mention they do their stuff at the Marina Civic Center, which means that there's always some going on there. The Marina Civic Center brings in different people. The Bay Arts Alliance helps them. The Bay Arts Alliance is an incredible organization here in Bay County, and we're going to find out a little bit more about it. Let's check it out. We are here with Jennifer Jones, who is the executive director of the Bay Arts Alliance. And the Bay Arts Alliance does so many things for the community, but right now we are focused on four huge shows. We, have, we are starting things off with Cirque Dreams Illuminations, correct? Right. That is a production from the same company that brought us Cirque Dreams Jungle Fantasy last year. We'll have Illuminations on October 8th at mm -hmm. 7.30 p.m. And it's a beautiful show. I've seen clips of it, and it looks like a lot of fun, a lot of acrobatics, and... Uh, audiences will be pleasantly surprised but also get what they're expecting too. Okay and then the next show is actually Camelot. Camelot is a classic musical. It's been all around the world. It's been around forever mm -hmm. and it's a beautiful musical and we're glad to make it a part of our series and so if you're familiar with King Arthur and Lancelot and Guinevere then you'll love to see this classic on the stage and it's a great big show. Yes and that's, that doesn't stop there. No, we have in January, we have The Wedding Singer. If you're a fan of 80s music, Billy Idol, Tina Turner, uh, Cindy Lauper, all the people I went to high school with, <laughs> uh, then that'll be January 21st. And um, then in February, on Fat Tuesday, we'll have Hairspray. I know, I'm so excited about this one, too. I am, too. In fact, they call Hairspray the Big Fat Musical, so I can't think of a better day to have it than on Big Fat Tuesday. Absolutely. So um, all those shows happen here at the Marina Civic Center, and they happen at 7.30 p.m., and they're all national tours, and the talent is excellent. Wonderful. And now I know that Bay Arts Alliance is bringing in these huge acts to the Marina Civic Center, but the Marina Civic Center does some things on its own as well. We do. Well, um, there are outside promoters and other pre presenters that bring in tours, uh, country, comedy, operas, ballets, everything. But in addition to the performances that go on in the theater, people can use the facility for meetings and wedding receptions because it is a community building, so it's, it's everyone's house. There's a lot to see and do here, mm -hmm. especially thanks to the Bay Arts Alliance. And where can they get more information on all these shows? Well, on the shows, if you want to just go straight to the where you can buy tickets, you need to go to marinaciviccenter.com. And if you would like more information on Bay Arts and what we do uh, as far as philanthropy in the community, go to bayarts.org. They link together, and uh, you need to go back often and check the calendar on marinaciviccenter.com because it changes all the time. Make sure you come out and see some of these fantastic Bay Arts Alliance shows. Not only are you going to get great entertainment, but keep in mind, these big shows that the Bay Arts Alliance puts on helps them provide free shows for all Bay District school children. It gets them cultured, it helps them enjoy a great time with the arts, and it's all provided by you. So come out to the Marina Civic Center, check out some of these incredible Bay Arts Alliance shows, and help support your own community here with Emerald Coast Hotspots.